One Train of the fastest the rising. Mm -hmm. You know how like a normal trajectory is like kind of a diagonal line? His is going like a little up right now. Yeah, this is like, C Sports. Like in a vertical motion. But and that's not normal. <laughs> C Sports is up against a formidable challenger right now because this is Psycon. Psycon is one of the best Ikes in North America right now. And I believe they got like 9 for 13th at Let's Make Big Moves or sh not Let's Make Big Moves, uh, Big House or Shine. So we already know they are the real deal. Yep. And so is C. So we got two people who are the real deal. Two Titans hey, of their guys, own respective states. If you guys thought we got fake uh, top players here, you were sadly mistaken. Yeah. This is the real show here. And yep. right now, see, locking it down right here with the Palu, controlling that space. You can see Psychi kind of just commanding that respect with the upbeat. Just trying to say, get off me. But C going for the up air on the mix. Yep. And uh, C is th coming off of a quid win. One a, one a, uh, oh, the quid game win. Yeah. Yeah. Won a tournament over quid, right? Yeah. Very recently. So he is definitely feeling good about himself. It, it is his turf, too. Like, you gotta be feeling like the confidence is throwing through this man. I believe C and Quid always go kind of like back to back with games and sets. Yeah. So it's definitely uh, quite a testament to how strong C is. Yeah. For those of you unfamiliar with his game, you know, uh, just just apologize when you when you see the amazing gameplay right here. Yep. Up B. Okay. Up B. That move did get buffed, but it's not gonna quite kill in this situation right here. I can see Psycho just trying to go for the up tilt to the anti air. Out the jump, C. He's got no jump. How does he get down? Sunami, how does he get down? We're not getting down. <laughs> We're on a one way trip to back air town, but F tilt overextending. Okay, I'll give you that one. I'll give you that one. Yep, that was nice. That was nice. But uh, C starting in with a 100% 100% stock lead on the second stock, which is uh, pretty nice if you're, if you're a C fan. Yeah, and this is honestly a pretty tough matchup for Ike because Paul is just so good at kind of just walling you out. But you really just need that one in, like you're seeing right here. Just the immediate IDJ back here to kind of cover it up. And now you're back to the ledge shop in there. Kind of oh. trap it out. See what options they're going to do. Going for the teleport. I'm going to chase it with up there. Yeah. I'm on to you, see. Yeah, uh, it was a really uh, good option from C to realize that Ike's kind of a slow character. <laughs> Get out of there with the teleport. But Psycho doing a really good job following it up. All right, let's see how they're going to play out this next ledge interaction, all right? The up throw to kind of just get them on the mix and almost covering the platform with the back air. So good, but catching the dash back with the dash attack. I love Ike dash attack callouts. They're like, yeah, you want to dash back? Nah, not today, bro. Not today. I got a juicy dash attack coming. Oh, okay. Shielding that up in time. It's all aboard the C train right now. I did not know you could challenge that move with Paul Tina up there and just get 40% off of that. That was crazy. Is that multi-hit all the way on up? All right, parry game. This is the one weakness about Sorties. Once you get that predictable game plan, once you get that one aerial kind of getting parried, it might be curtains for you in this game one here. Oh, no jump. And yeah. the win box. That was the win box. That was actually crazy. Winbox is that was actually crazy. Paul, Paul Winbox irks Bro, he me. Was gonna it irks me in the wrong way. Bro, he would actually have rather gotten hit with the move there, because then he would have gotten his side beat back. But he got hit by the Winbox and it heated him. God. <laughs> when Paul is utilized that fucking um, what was it the Winbox? The win they it's like they're think, already they're already C big. Did it, do you think C did it on purpose? It was on purpose. You, you already it, know it was on how purpose. How many heads was he? Was he seven heads? The thing is, like, it was covering two options at that point. It was covering that side B, right? Yeah. But if he connected to the ledge or if he, like fell short, and if he kind of just ran into him, it, yeah. it would have not traded. It would have sure. just hit face on. He's just too good. He's just too good. He's just too big brain of a player for Psychod right now. And Psychod's got to get him a little bit of the big brain plays in his own. Which is starting off really strong in this game one. Let's see if we can continue it. Now, Triplat scares me against Ike because they can make some really good kind of combos and juggles going with Nair into the up air. Because, you know, you get that one grab, you kind of just look for the opening to watch your opponent kind of just land. Like you're seeing right here, Psychon really just fishing for those down tilts, just trying to get a shield poke on in. But see, it's probably Once you get that opening, you get a lot of damage going. But right now, Psychon is taking that first, first uh, stop. That's dash attack counter two. For those of you who are paying attention, uh, I am, because I love that move. It's such a cool move. Um, yeah, Psygod's definitely uh -oh. starting this game off a lot better. The stage choice of Town and City uh, looking very nice for uh, Psygod. This is a traditionally very good stage for Palutena because of the small side blast zones, which is where Palutena gets most of his best work. 
Okay. Nair went into another Nair to send him back in the corner. Now, I want to see how C is going to be able to deal with the switch up kind of going forward. As you can see, Psychot has been on a rampage currently and just taking a, almost another stock off the Nair to the back here. Looking to just two frame with the neutral B. They switch up to this aggressive playstyle that C is kind of just uh, fumbling to get around. Yeah, uh, for sure. And uh, kind of number three. I was going to say, like, let's see how long C can keep this stock going, but uh, decided to lose it instantly, which is a bold strategy, I think, personally. It is what it is. It is what it is. It For is sure, it is what it is. All right, but Psychod definitely showing that he is not out of this set for sure. It was looking kind of rough out of game one, but the, the download is almost complete. It's not quite complete yet, but it's 90% there. There's a few more key steps we need in the Matrix there. Yeah. We're almost quite there. It's like when you, it's like when you, it's like when you're almost done finishing downloading and it's like, oh, not enough storage space. You gotta yeah. find a little bit more storage space. Downloading that RAM. Yeah. But I like to see, I'm, I like that C got that DI unlock not to just fall victim to that upbeat because that upbeat, if you're near the blast zone, it will kill. That boy is ridiculously strong. Yeah, for sure. And, uh, <laughs> Like has a lot of strong moves, actually, and C is at that percent where you have to fear almost literally all of his moves. Like, like any any of them can kill right now, which yeah. is pretty sad. And the one thing you want to get hit by is grab, so the last two times he's gotten hit is grab, so that's pretty nice. Yeah, you can see that Psychod is kind of just pressuring C, but by simply just existing, being in that kind of threat race to kind of just threaten these grabs and just mixing it up with a dash attack. Dash attack counter three! You can see. I like it. I like the mix, right? You go for no attacks, right? You get the grab, but then you start coming on in there, and then you start swinging, delaying your attacks. He's like, "Oh my god, I'm not, I'm not ready for the mix. I'm not yep. ready for the switch up. Hold on, hold on." Yup, he was definitely not ready for those dash attacks. C has never seen that move in his life. He's like, "This move's so bad. It's so it's it's, it's so whip punishable. Why are you using it on me?" Also, the thing about Ike, right? Ike has uh, his wave bounce side B is pretty annoying to punish. You have to just call that out. When you when it lands, it's basic. It basically yeah. just auto. -cancels. Have we seen him miss a dash check? I think all of his dash no. checks have hit. Honestly, so he's he's hitting them. He's hitting them in the matrix. He's reading his soul. But right now, I gotta turn on my little bias commentary for a little bit because this is C Sports. C Sports may be clutching right, it up. All right, all right, we're both going. We're both going bias. I'll, I'll root for Psychot. You root for C. I got you. I got you. All right, all right. Thanks, Psychot big... is fucking him up. Okay. <laughs> He's, he's messing him up. Hey, yo, C, <laughs> talk to this man right now. Back her it out. Bro, he easy just, stocks. Like, easy like we said, When the download was almost complete, it's complete now. It is complete. Listen, it's only complete for C Sports right now. <laughs> C Sports, they complete? got this. It's complete? C, he, got got hit with a, he got hit with another dash check. He doesn't know what to do about that move. He's never seen that move in his life. Bro didn't even get hit by <laughs> the two frame of neutral B, all right? <laughs> I. I, when have you seen uh, Psychod get edge guarded this entire set? Game one, maybe? He hasn't. Yeah. C has, has got nothing on those since game two. Uh, we'll see. Right now, they're going pretty much toe to toe in this. Sorty, dash attack, not really closing out right here. That dash attack getting mighty stale. Oh, I love the jab from Psychod. <laughs> yeah, you can see him just kind of just pushing oh, his approach, but right now, back throw to the ledge. That's okay. The first and last uh, dash attack that Psychod will whiff this entire set. By the way, for those of you who are wondering in the chat. Yeah, Psychod wasn't able to get that close quarters explosive flame. So. Amazing forward tilt there from Psychod, who yeah. is two stocks away from moving on in the winner's bracket here at the Let's Make Big Moves free local Oh, wasn't able to get the confirm off the parry, but okay. Palu dash, Palu back here. It does not matter. It does not matter. Yep. <laughs> Paul Backer just kind of plays the game for you sometimes, just like this Nair. Exactly. I love <laughs> playing neutral with Paula Backer. Just <laughs> Nair four times, get my yep. up air off. I was a Palutena man for a, a cool second, and that was definitely fun. Just spacing with Backer. The opponent was like, what do you do? I'm too fast. Went from Palutena to Ridley. How the world be. Yeah. How the world be. And, and some, you know what? I think I made the right choice. Ridley's the better character. Okay. You can see that C is starting to catch on to Psychod's kind of charges. Yeah. They're downloading, they're downloading each other's like game plans, you know, and adjusting in real time. It's insane to see. Yeah, these quick draws, they're kind of not working out as C, just catching onto it and taking it off the explosive flame. You, you can see the crowd. There's a, I don't even know if they're watching right now. I don't know. There's a, but lot, there's a lot of people here. Maybe it's a crowd. Maybe it's just a lot of people in this venue. 
Who knows? But, but uh, if this is if you're not hyped for this set, then you are uh, truly not watching this. I don't the know street. what set you're gonna be hyped for, you know? Because this is some of the best ultimate gameplay you're gonna see all night. Yeah, we got the Palu Nair trade all around. Alright. No punish on the side behind, however, but See, set it up once again in the corner with the jab. He's trying to, to go jump the all the way out there with that backer. That was insane for C. I, I see why people like him now after that back air, that whiffed. You can tell a lot about a, kid, a player when they whiff like a really cool option. It says a lot about them. Yeah, and okay, down tilt taken out, but C not going for the throw, just waiting to see what option Psychot's gonna choose. Kind of hanging back here, looking for that dash stack and okay. just building up that chip damage. I, I think C won the set as soon as he adjusted to the dash stacks. We haven't seen him get hit by a dash stack in a very long time. This shows. Hey, yo, watch your jet! Watch your jet! What you say? <laughs> I, I, I gotta, I gotta disappear because I was just repping Psychot and. Uh, Let's go, C Sports. But yeah, it I'll was, pop it off just a little bit. It was I'll pop it off. It was an amazing time being with you guys today. I hope you guys. Enjoyed the gameplay that you saw so far.